This is Andrew Stotts of A. Stotts Investment Research. Today I'm talking about world-class benchmarking and I'm looking at the group, uh, Fufang Group Limited, a Chinese company listed in the Hong Kong stock market. So let's get some background on this company. First of all, Fufang Group is a Chinese-based company focused on manufacturing amino acids from which it produces the biggest worldwide sales of MSG. The group has five plants in Northeast Asia, well-placed geographically for obtaining cheap corn, the raw material used in the production of its key products, including xanthan gum. <clears throat> Let's look at the company here for a moment. The ticker code is 546 in Hong Kong. The market cap is just a, a, over a, a billion U.S. at 1.2 billion. Average daily turnover is 3.6, and the beta of the company is at 0.5. The sector is material sector, and the free float of the company is about 40%. Let's look at what's happening at the company. Fu Feng is, is a Chinese fermentation company with four major businesses largely focused on amino acids. Its bi bi biggest single product by far is MSG, the flavor enhancer, which accounts for just more than half of total revenue. Its annual capacity is about 1.1 million tons. The second major division is animal feed and related products, which includes corn refined products and the essential amino acid 309, which is added to food. This accounts for just under a quarter of revenue. The two remaining divisions are xanthan gum with applications as non-toxic thickener and stabilizer, which is used in food and pharmaceutical production and in industry and also high-end amino acids also used to add food, protein, and also used in medicine. Total production of xanthan gum is 73,000 tons per year, and Fufang is ranked number three globally for sales. The company sells mainly in the domestic Chinese market. Fufang has five plants in northeast China, one of the country's major corn-growing region. This allows the firm to easily obtain low-cost raw material. So let's look at the revenue breakdown of the company, and we can see MSG 54%, animal feed 21, xanthan gum 5, and amino acids and others 20%. Now that we understand this company a little bit more, let's look at the world-class benchmarking scorecard of the company. How is its fundamental performance? First of all, we want to look at the chairman of the company, and we can see that the chairman's been there since 1999, Li Shun Chun. And we can also see that the uh, president, in this case, has been president until 2016. But the new president, Mr. Zhao Qing, is present, president since 2016. So most of the, pro the, the success of the company has to be attributed to the prior president. So let's take a look and see that profitable growth improved to a top three in PTM in the prior 12 months. It ranked among the top 225 of 750 large material companies worldwide. So a three ranking is not so bad, improving from a six. <clears throat> Profitability and growth saw strong improvement, both of them up to a number three in the past 12 months. That's good. Now, let's take a look at the next layer, and we can see asset utilization is average at about a five, and it's improved uh, profit margin has improved to a number three, so good progress on profit margin. And sales growth is just above average at a four, and margin change improved to a number two. So good improvement on margin change, and that's part of what's driving the EPS growth of the company. Actually, if I was going to think about how to improve the profitability of this company, I would focus on asset utilization, which is average, and try to increase that by looking at the balance sheet and understanding what assets are and are not producing revenue. The second thing I would focus on is continuing the progress on the margin change. Overall, good improvements there, and I like to see that, particularly when we're considering looking at investing in a company. You want to see more? Well, just sign up for our free newsletter and get access to more investment knowledge at becomeabetterinvestor.net slash join. I'll see you there.